this video is going to be a short tutorial on how to update your graphics drivers. So in case if you're having issues with lags, freezes, game stutters, or if a certain game or program simply isn't working properly, it could well be a driver's issue. In this tutorial, I will talk about four simple methods on how to update your graphics drivers for integrated as well as for dedicated graphics cards. First and by far the simplest way to check for a graphics driver update is well through the Windows Update service. You can access this service simply by typing check for updates check for updates in the Windows search function and then clicking check for updates application. This should open up the Windows Update service. Basically, this service scans your entire system and checks if any piece of hardware or the operating system itself requires a driver update. So it doesn't just check the graphics card for a driver update, but the rest of the system and its components. You need to be connected to the internet for this service to work. So when I press this check for update button here, this service will scan my PC, including both the integrated and the dedicated graphics card for a driver update. It may take a moment to check for the updates. If there is a new driver detected, then the service will prompt you to download and install it. Fortunately, all my drivers are up to date. The second method of updating the drivers is through the device manager. For this, open the device manager. You can access device manager through many ways. I will just right click this PC, head over to manage and then select device manager from the window that opens. Now in the device manager, expand the section labeled as display adapters. The expanded list tells me all the graphics card that I have installed on my PC. It also tells me their make and model. So here I have two graphics cards, an integrated Intel HD 630 and the dedicated NVIDIA GTX 1050 Ti. Now in order to update any one of these, double click on the graphics card you wish to update. I will just double click on my integrated Intel HD 630 graphics card. In the properties window that opens, select the drivers tab. This should now show you a list of options. Here click on the update driver button. This prompt asks you how you wish to update the driver. Press search automatically for drivers. You need to be connected to the internet for this service to work as well. Here you can see that the scan has detected that, all, that I already have the best drivers installed. However, this scan has a big caveat that you can read for yourself. It says there may be a better drivers on Windows Update or on the device's manufacturer website. So while this method is great as a beginner step, it is not definitive and can be broken. Which brings us to the next method which is to download and install the graphics drivers manually. There are three major graphics card manufacturers out there, Intel, Nvidia and AMD. These three brands have their respective websites where you can find and download the drivers for the graphics card you have manually. To download the graphics card drivers manually, you will need to know the exact make and model of your graphics card first. I already figured that out from the device manager. I have the Intel HD 630 integrated graphics card and the NVIDIA GTX 1050 Ti dedicated graphics card. So for instance, since I have the NVIDIA GTX 1050 Ti on my laptop PC, to download its drivers, I will head over to the NVIDIA's official website. Uh, then I will head over to its drivers page where I can download its uh, exact driver. In the search function uh, I see on this page, I uh, will need to put the correct details of my graphics card, which I already figured out earlier from the device manager was NVIDIA GTX 1050 Ti. Similarly, AMD has their own website for downloading graphics drivers manually. This is the official download center for AMD. You can see a similar search function here as we saw with NVIDIA earlier. Intel also has their dedicated download center. This is the Intel's download center page. Here you would select a graphics card from the product list. And on the page that opens, on the left hand filter menu, you would find the, uh, the model of your integrated graphics card to download its corresponding drivers. I've included the links for where you can download the NVIDIA, AMD and Intel drivers manually in the description below. Next is yet again a fairly simple method and this involves using the manufacturer's auto detect tool to install the drivers. This is great if you do not know the make and model of your graphics card or if you simply do not want to go through the hassle of manual installation. Intel, Nvidia and AMD all have auto detect tools for automatically downloading and updating the graphics driver. 
This over here is the official auto detect tool for Intel products. This page here shows you how to download and install the AMD auto detect and install tool. And finally, with Nvidia you can download and run the tool from this page by clicking on the download now button here under the automatic drivers update section. Yeah. I have included the links to these tools in the description below as well. So there you have it. These are my four recommended ways on how to update graphics drivers on Windows. If you have any question or comments then let me know below. Also if you have learned something of value from this video then I would appreciate a like and a subscribe.